as you can see, I'm in a new setup. It's coming together, it's coming together. If you missed my last little mini vlog that I just threw up, I was showing y'all some of the stuff that came into the house. But first, welcome back. Welcome back to Just Kidding May channel. It's your first time here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's back. You've been rocking with me, rolling with me. Oh my God. So yes, it's coming all together. If you're new, if you didn't know, if you didn't catch it, I bought a house earlier in the year. So that's pretty much why I gotta get it together. You know, you know. So the background is this. Still got work to do. Still got work to do. I'm doing a gallery wall and a wall back there and I, there's still more work to be done. All right? No, I gotta get my life together. I gotta get back on track. And what I mean by that is the gym. That's what I mean by that. When it comes to the house, you know, I'm still, I'm just getting that together and there's been boxes, there's been this, there's been that. Like there's some boxes over there you can probably see. I just need to get things in order. So, I did some cleaning this morning. I still got some more cleaning to do and some organizing to get together in that aspect. That's on track, we rocking and rolling with that. Then, the gym situation, y'all, it's been a struggle. I mentioned it's been a struggle before, but ever since I moved, I haven't been in my routine. Like, I haven't got back to the routine yet. I do go to the gym. It's not a consistent, like, oh yeah, I'm going Monday through Friday, or I'm going every other day. It's not like that. It's like, I might go Saturday, Sunday, not go again until Wednesday, then Saturday and Sunday again, then a random day for the week. It's just been a struggle. So I really do need to get back on track of my fitness, even my health. Like I haven't been doing well. And I mentioned this before, that's why I haven't been popping out no meal prep videos. I've been doing the bare minimum when it comes to cooking. I just need to get back on track of fitness, health, and everything. Everything in that realm. And then we just gotta get this house in order. I got a new rug for the living room. So in the mini vlog, I showed y'all pretty much the dining room and then a lamp and my new bed. I feel like I showed y'all something else in that, but the lamp, I got the light bulb to go in it because when I was putting it together, I was like, oh, I forgot I was supposed to buy that separately because I didn't buy it. But now they have it. So let me show y'all my little lampy lamp. It's, I don't know where it's gonna go yet. I'm thinking it's gonna go in the corner, but I just don't know which corner. It makes sense to put it in the corner it's in right now, but we'll see about that. And also, this is the new living room rug. I don't know if it's staying here. And I, I'll say that because I saw another rug that I kind of liked a little better for the living room. However, they don't have it in the eight by 10. They only have it in smaller sizes. And I don't know why they chose to only do it in smaller sizes. So I'm trying to find a dupe of it. So we'll see if I find a dupe of it or not. If I don't keep this rug in the living room, then I'm gonna put it in my room because it would match with my room since it's gonna be creams, gold. It's gonna be creams, browns, golds, and all that type of stuff in the room. That's the feel. So I hope it comes out how I envision, and then I'm doing a wardrobe wall. So that's pretty much that. But as of today, I cleaned up a little bit, as y'all see me, uh, you know, we cleaned up a little bit. I am going to be cooking I need to make some lunch, so we're gonna make some lunch in a bit. Are we going to the gym today? We gonna see about that, we're gonna see about that. I want to, I wanna go on lunch, but at the same time, I just feel like when I go during lunch, I have to squish it all in and I don't get to have my rest periods and whatnot. And I don't know about that. We'll see about that. And then we gotta organize, I gotta get my room together again. My room always gets disorganized, y'all know this, because I got clothes, I got stuff. It's, it's always disorganized. And then the bathroom, it's way smaller. If you didn't catch it, my bathroom's small now compared to how it used to be. And it gets disorganized a lot. So we gotta do that and I gotta put my artwork. I finally have to put that up. I've been slacking on that. So we got a few things we're gonna do today. I want to just check in, talk a little bit, talk a little bit, you know, do that. And if you, you know, something else, I'm settling into my new position as well. I left my last place of work and went to another place, I got another position. So still settling into that, it honestly feels like I've been there longer than, than I have. I actually need to finish up working, I'm on break right now. 
I need to finish up working and then we'll, we'll see what we gotta do. I'm gonna eat uh, I'm gonna eat some watermelon. I thought I had a pre-cooked hamburger patty that I was going to consume right now for lunch, but I guess that ain't happening because it ain't in the refrigerator. So watermelon as of right now, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna eat. Maybe a salad because I made some homemade ranch. And if you don't know, homemade buttermilk ranch is where it's at. And if you ain't never had it, you need to make it. I just look simple like that. Restaurant style dressing. This is it. Get this. Try it. If you don't like ranch, then I got another recommendation for you. Now, if you know, you know. If you know, if you've been here, you know. But this um, vinaigrette, this blush wine vinaigrette, strawberry or this blush wine, same brand, bomb. Bomb. I could cut up some tomatoes and cucumbers and just pour this on it. Bomb. But anyway, there's that little tidbit for y'all. Um, I'm gonna eat some watermelon and figure out what I'm gonna eat. I'm really disappointed there's no hamburger. But I will say, I picked up some stuff that I saw. Um, let's see this. And this. So, when I was in the seasoning aisle, the last time I went to the store, I saw this air fryer Buffalo Red Hot for some wings. I don't have wings. I was going to put them on my boneless chicken. But I said, why not give it a try? I like their sauce. So I do have use their sauce. Y'all saw me use their sauce before. Then I saw this lemon pepper ranch seasoning. I have had lemon pepper, you know, seasoning before, but I've never had this one and it's new. And I said, why not give it a try? And then also this garlic Parmesan that I found at the store as well. So I'm gonna give this a try. I don't know, this one was a random. I mean, that's super, this one was a super random. But this is what I bought to go with the boneless chicken and I was gonna pop it in the air fryer. So that's kind of the intention. I don't know if the boneless, I don't know if the chicken is even good anymore, but that was the intention behind me buying this stuff. I need to get some little pillow cushions because I really do like just plopping down here. And I forgot to close the refrigerator correctly. Okay, hold on one moment. Anyway, back to what I was saying. I want to get some of the those floor cushions, pad thingies, because that's that's my vibe, y'all. That's my vibe. Mm. Are we talking a lot in this video? Yeah, we are. But I wanted to say, I'm sorry, I'm eating with my mouth open and whatnot. But I want to say I called my granddad. I was just in um, Atlanta, Stone Mountain, Decatur, which is out there. What? Beginning of July? Yeah, beginning of the Jul July for my family reunion. So I was just out there. My grandparents was hosting. They live in Stone Mountain. So I went out there, hung out, did my little thing, right? I told you all a little bit about it. If you missed it, you missed it. But I called my granddad on Wednesday because it was his birthday. So I called my granddad. I called my grandma and she has an iPhone. My granddad doesn't have an iPhone. So I called my grandma and I said, hey, are you at home? I wanted to say, you know, hop on FaceTime. And she wasn't at home and whatnot, but she was all telling me something, something, something. Blah, 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 blah. And then she said that she wanted to come out here. I said, okay. Let's do it. But at the same time, I'm all like, oh, I gotta host my grandma. And then I said, is this how she feels? Because she always asks my cousin, what can you young kids do out here? And da da da. And it's always, I'm all like, oh, I get it. Because I'm like, if she's out here for a whole weekend, what am I gonna do with her? And at the same time, I don't want her on the move all the time. And so she said, let me know what weekends. And I was like, oh, all right. So she's coming out here. Tell me what y'all be doing with your grandmas. I was thinking about taking her to a winery. Where I live, there's a lot of 
places I could go. One of those places being Napa. And I said, okay, well maybe we could do a Napa weekend and then I'll hit up my sisters and see, um, you know, if they wanna come, what they doing. But I was all like, we'll see what happens. Um, I'm hoping they're available when she comes out here because that's that's really all that's out here. So none of my other family lives in my city on my dad's side. So my grandma coming out here, it would really just be seeing me, my sister and my other sister. That's it. And then of course, like my mom, um, but that's it there. So there's not as if it's like, oh, let's go take her to visit so-and-so and let's go visit the cousins and let's go visit these people. So it's nothing like that. So that's where I'm like, what can I do with her? Where she's not bored, but I don't feel like I'm jam packing her schedule with, oh, we gotta go here and we gotta go there. So tell me what y'all be doing with your grandma. Because when I'm out there, we really just be chilling. We be at the house, we go to the store. We just can't, we just, it's like a casual, regular day when I'm out there and I'm hanging out with her. We might go pick up my cousin's kids from, you know, their schools. It's super casual. Um, so that's why I'm all like, oh. So that's why I'm thinking Napa chime in let me know what y'all be doing um and yeah help me out here but that's what i'm thinking like a little chill day maybe you know get a room out there do a whole spa day winery dinner there's this michelin star restaurant i want to go out oh, like it's so mm, it's so beautiful it looks beautiful but you know sometimes pictures are disappointing but i don't know that's the thought we'll see what happens chime in let me know what y'all be doing and yeah I'm gonna finish eating my watermelon.